Okay, so I have had so many DMs today asking me to show you how to do the pizza for our new followers. So we're gonna do it just really fast, okay? I'm gonna show you from start to finish, okay? I forgot to get my bowl out. Oh my gosh, hold on. I forgot to get my bowl out, sorry. Okay, I'm gonna show you really fast from uh, the start of my yeast to, are people on? Can people see? There's can anybody my, yeah. see? Mm hmm They can? Yeah. Okay, I just did something to my pants. Okay, so now I've said before, you want some warm water as you are creating your yeast, okay? So I just like to get something like this. Um, I love the OXO brand, I think it's great. Here's our all-star yeast again that I keep talking about all the time. So we're gonna put one tablespoon of yeast into our water. And this one does not call for sugar. Some of them do, some of them don't. If, you're, if your yeast is really not doing good, I say you can add a little bit of sugar, but it's fine. So you just wanna get a spoon, kinda mix it, like this, not overdo it. And then you're gonna cover it with a plate. I like to cover it with a plate. So you've got your, um, you know, the heat being contrapped. Do we have anybody say anything? Huh? No. No. Okay. Ask anything at any time. I'm just, I'm having my husband help me right now. Okay. So now we're gonna do ta two tablespoons of olive oil. This is the really fast five minute dough. The other one, like I said, I've got it rising over here and I'm gonna show you in a minute, but this is the really fast olive oil one. So we've had two tablespoons of olive oil and one tablespoon of honey. Can you see it, Chris? Mm-hmm. Okay, now one four teaspoon of salt, our amazing, amazing salt. Let me get the bag. Hold on. These live videos are live, people. <laughs> they are scary. Okay, this is my amazing salt, okay, that you get. This is literally from France. You get it at World Market. Amazing. Okay, so now we're going to add one four teaspoon. Look at this amazing thing, by the way, that we're going to start selling again for super cheap. It's a tablespoon, a teaspoon, a half a teaspoon, a quarter teaspoon, all in one. Isn't that the greatest thing? I'm obsessed with mine. So we're gonna start selling those again because people love them. So you're gonna put one four teaspoon of salt, okay? Now, when it, when, so it says three to four cups of flour, okay? So remember you don't wanna add the full amount of flour because depending on weather, depending on your flour, you just wanna take it at a time, okay? So we're going to do that. So if it calls for three cups, I'm gonna do two. Anybody saying anything? Yeah, someone said much cheaper at World Market. Yeah, it is much cheaper there. It is. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, so now we're going to add about two cups to our... Okay, hold on. Oh my gosh. I always think I'm ready for these, you guys. I forgot my one cup of warm water to add to your dough. Hold on. No. <laughs> I'm not a pro, okay? I don't have a cooking show, so this is scary for me. Oh, okay, so if you do not have a pizza stone, you need to invest in one because that is where you're going to get a real authentic crust. Turn up your oven as hot as it can go. Mine actually will go to 550. So you want your stone to be sitting in there for at least 30 minutes before you start uh, really using it because you want it really hot, really hot and get it going, okay? Okay, so we've added this. Um, I'm just making sure that I am adding. Okay, why am I confused for a second? Okay, so now we're going to add our yeast mixture. So this one, I've showed you before, but this one, is not, look, it's not going that crazy. My, the, when I did the other crust, it was going crazy. 
If your yeast is just going like this, some of you are like, mine is not super foamy. That's okay. Do you see how it's like activating and it's going? It's hard so, to see. It kind of washed out. Well, it's just gonna be. It's gonna be good. Okay. So you're going to add this. I'm so tired right now. I feel like I'm kind of losing it. I guess I don't add another cup of water. I'm thinking. I'm thinking of the baguettes. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we're going to mix. So the minute your dough starts coming away from the bowl, your your dough is done. And my gosh, look, it's almost done and we've only added two cups so far. So we're going to add a little more, okay? But this is basically almost coming away from the bowl. Are there, are there any questions? Someone just said, this is your cooking show. No, it's not. And someone also said, we love watching your lives. Oh my gosh. Me and my daughters. Well, that's nice. I, I'm i a nervous wreck. Oh my gosh. I always think I'm ready for him. I'm not. Okay, so look. That was not even three cups. So always add less than what the dough calls for. So look how crazy this is. Okay, I, I've told you before that I'm in a rental. And so I've got cold granite and sometimes I just think it's warmer to uh, do your dough or, you know, your baguettes or whatever, like on a, a, a breadboard, you know, because it's kind of more warm. So take a little bit of flour down. I mean, this is pizza crust in five minutes, you guys, five minutes. No rising on this one. No, nothing. Okay. So look how that is done. My gosh, okay? See, it's done. So, now, we like really thin, authentic pizza crust. So, we turn into every batch that we do is three pizzas. This is three thin pizzas, okay? So, I love my dough scraper. Like I said, get your dough scraper. Just kind of divide it out. And you might think it's like really, really thin at first, but it actually comes up too. Anyways, is anybody else saying anything? Yeah, so you got, you're fine, you're great. Oh gosh. You are the cutest. I love watching your videos Stop every it. morning. Stop it. And then you have, tell her her hair looks awesome like that too. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys. Oh my gosh. Man, I love all of you. You're my new best friends. This is Costco's so funny. no uh this lady says uh, Costco's no longer carrying the yeast, so she's sad. They aren't? Sad emoji. Oh, well, maybe they've got something else then. I just bought this not that long ago, but what? I do live in Colorado. Maybe you live, I don't know, where do you live? Okay, so <laughs> this is my favorite French rolling pin, like I keep telling you. What? I must mention husband of the year. Oh yeah, husband of the year. <laughs> wow, yeah. <laughs> this is hilarious. Okay, this is amazing. Calif okay. California. Oh, California. Uh, yeah. Costco's carry different stuff, I guess. Well, get whatever. Get whatever they have. Get whatever they have. It's going to be good. I just think it's better than the yeast packets. Okay? Okay, so... If you live in Utah, this is at Orson Gigi, okay? If you don't, I live here in Colorado and I just found this at our kitchen outlet store. And I know every Tinker outlet has a kitchen outlet store. This is $9. It's amazing, 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 okay? So, look how fast. Okay, so we're gonna now really show this. You're gonna roll it super, super thin. So just start. Start turning it, start turning it like this. If it's not perfectly round, you're gonna be okay, okay? So we're just gonna keep turning it. Keep rolling it out. Look how thin we're going to have this crust. Can you really see it? Huh? Chris? Yeah. Okay. Got it. If you want to be really fancy, my mom's really good at this. I mean, look, we are kind of oh, like, shoot. sorry, we've got people coming <laughs> over for dinner. Oh my gosh, we've got people coming over for dinner. Okay, so now you need this. This is a pizza peel, and I think that you need two of them because one, you need to prepare it on one, then another one, you take it out, okay? So the way you do it is don't put a ton of this, but you put a little bit, a flour like this 
And then we like to put white cornmeal, okay? There's a difference between the yellow, use the white. And then just a little bit of this, okay? So now, this is where you've got to go pretty fast because your dough is gonna start rising on the peel, so it's gonna start sticking, okay? So you just kinda wanna make sure that it's going like this. So we're gonna do this really fast. My kids are so hungry for pepperoni. So I'm just gonna show you a pepperoni really fast, okay? So we've made our homemade sauce. Any more questions? So we're just gonna go like this. Where can they find a breadboard like that? Um, anywhere. I mean, you know who has really good breadboards for cheap is actually Home Goods, really cheap, and they're really great. So you can find it anywhere. And these pills, you can get a pizza stone at a kitchen outlet. You can get a pizza stone anywhere. You can get the peel anywhere. I have different stones. I have different peels. I love all of them. Okay, I'm trying to do this faster. So I'm just gonna show you how I'm going to do this, okay? So we've got some sauce down. We're gonna hurry and just put some cheese. This is not my fancy one. Wait till I show you the arugula one, okay? But this is just my kids are hungry. So we're just gonna make a pepperoni. You don't wanna add too many toppings, like too much cheese, you know? Just evenly do it. Then we've got, any other questions? I don't know. But like I said, you don't want this to sit too long because if you do, it's going to stick, okay? But don't put too much flour, don't put too much cornmeal down, but you wanna, you wanna hurry. You wanna hurry pretty fast, okay? Any questions so far? Nope. Okay. Um, I hope you all are having a good Friday night. I mean, sorry you're sitting here watching me for a minute. Okay, so come over here. So we've got our pizza stone going in our hot, hot oven. So now look how easy this is. You want to start from the back and just start letting it slide off, like slowly, like this. Perfect. Okay, so now when it's super hot in your oven, this is gonna cook fast, like eight minutes probably fast if your oven can go as high as this one. So we're gonna let it go for like eight minutes and we're gonna check it. And then let me show you how to do the arugula really fast, okay? I'll get this one done. So this is our, this is the, okay. The dough I just did is in the first cookbook, okay? It's the super fast five minute dough. This one is in the new cookbook and it's called the Tuscany Dough. My mom found this recipe. She got this recipe from really a little lady that lived in Tuscany and she shared this recipe with her. So I know some of you are like, I don't wanna buy the beer. I don't like that. That's totally fine. You don't have to do that. Um, use water, use O'Doul's if you want, whatever, but it does cook out. And I promise you the difference between each crust. I did a pizza class last week. They said hands down it was their favorite. So it definitely has a really good taste and it just makes like, the beer just makes it crispier. It's really, really good. So this one's been rising for a while. Mm -hmm. That's the questions. So I'm just gonna keep letting that rise, yeah. Yes. So where did you get the pizza stone? Okay, so I have two different ones. Let me show you because I get this question all the time. I have this one that I've had forever. I don't know exactly what kind it is. And then I got this clay one not that long ago. And they both work. It doesn't matter which one you get. They both, they all work. They is all it, work. Do you use the pampered chef stone? No, no, I don't. No, I don't. Why? Is Pamper Chef amazing? I don't know. No. I got, I've had that top one for eight years and I've had the other one, well, more than eight years, but, and then I just bought the bottom one because I wanted to try it out. A lot of you are like, which one do I get? It doesn't matter because both are fantastic. Both are great. Okay. So I'm going to show you my favorite, favorite, favorite one that my mom 
swear she brought it to the US, okay? She said that she went to Italy and said, I want your yummiest pizza you have. And this was forever ago, 35 years ago. And she, and they came out and it had arugula on top of it. It was a salad pizza and my mom had never seen it before. It is everybody's favorite, everybody's favorite. It's so, so good. Okay, so let me, let me do you. So let me show you that. So we're gonna roll out our crust, super thin. So we got King Arthur flour carries the stones, pills, and rolling pins. Oh, great. You can get them anywhere, you guys. William Sonoma, Sir Latab, Orson Gigi in Utah, the, the kitchen outlet. It doesn't, oh my. Well, it's okay if you get a little hole. You guys, you can come in. We have some guests and they can come in. Okay, I just kind of made a hole. So, oh my gosh, we have the missionaries here. We were feeding the missionaries. Oh my gosh, you guys, hi. Sorry, I'm showing a little cooking thing. How you doing? Guys. How you doing? Doing great. Okay, sorry, you guys. This is live. This is scary. Sorry, live. I forgot it was already. Sorry, missionaries. <laughs> no worries. We're no feeding. Worries. Well, I'm making homemade pizza. Perfect. Sweet. So wait till you have it. Okay, so let's check on our pizza really fast, though. Oh, yeah, it's looking good. Wait till you try my kind. Any other questions so far? I kind of... Got you got some comments. You want what, comments? What? What? We made the pizza at Amy's and it was to die for. Pizza what? At Amy's. Oh, well, yeah. My sister Amy has a pizza oven. She's a little stink. It yeah. says, I got notified that you were live and I was like, everyone be quiet. Love this and you. <laughs> I love you. I such love a, you. Such a pro. Dough oh recipe? Oh my gosh. What? Someone said dough recipe? Yeah, DM mark? me. DM me after and I'll give you a dough recipe. You know my, my, my little Instagram. Then sorry. you want the dough really thin? Yes, you do. Because thin crust is authentic. That is yummy. Look, look how thin this is. This is good. And you'll see it comes up. Okay, so I'm going to show you my favorite one really fast. Okay, so we're going to put a little bit of flour down. Callie, do you have the arugula? My friend was bringing my arugula. Um, so it says, what kind of board are you using to roll the dough on? It's just a bread board. I, I just, for some reason, I feel like granite is just so cold. So I like to... I like to do it, you know what I mean? Okay, so look at, oh my gosh, we're having a little technical difficulties here. Okay, okay, so look, I mean look. Wait till you try this arugula. So you, there's no sauce, it's olive oil, okay, is your sauce. Then you wanna get the fresh mozzarella from Costco, cause it's really cheap. You guys okay? Where is, um, shoot, you guys, I'm never prepared. Oh my gosh. I'm never prepared. Okay, now they come pre-sliced like this at Costco, but it's a little too much, it's a little too thick. So we've been starting to cut it like into four pieces or six. And then this is, so this is how you do it. Yeah? What, Chris? Anything? Huh? Oh, okay. Okay, so like this. Oh my gosh, I just love everybody's comments. You guys are so fun. We're having a pizza party over here. I wasn't planning on it, but we are. Costco okay. should be sending you some kickbacks. Gosh, Costco should, man. Yeah, you're right. Okay, so look, we're going to bake it like it's this. Then you top here. it with arugula and cherry tomatoes and salt and pepper. This is to die for. So come here again. Come here again. So you can see how I do it on the stone. Sorry. Excuse oh, me. Oh, and our other one. Oh, oh no. That Pizza's was getting done. done. Okay. Pizza's so look, done. Look. This is what you do, you guys. Kind of start at the end, and then you just slide it off. Oh, oh no. Okay, our pizza, <gasps> oh, we got oh, distracted. Oh, oh, yummy. Crispy. Okay, this got a little too done, but no it didn't. It's good, Looks it's great. great. Okay, so look. You guys, look at this. So. What kind of salt is that from World Market? And is, and is why is it better, sorry. Okay, so. My mom went on a mission. She got home a year ago and she was at all these restaurants in Europe and was like, why do these taste so good? 
and the chef couldn't really speak English and he said, come here. And he took her in the back and he showed her this bag of salt, okay? And a funny little side note, she literally, okay, I went to go visit her. She sent me home with like 10 bags for myself. She's like, you won't have this in America. Take, take, take. My mom filled up two suitcases full of this salt, for real, two big suitcases. And then we came home, it's at World Market. So, <laughs> funny stuff. But this is a game changer in everything you make. You use it teaspoon per teaspoon, and if you don't like how thick it is, you can buy it, you can buy it this way. This is more fine, it's just way more money. So I just, I don't buy this anymore. I buy it this way and I put it in my um, morsel, my morsel thing like this, Chris, like this. And I just kind of make it finer. But believe me, once you start trying this in your stuff, it's a game changer. Anyways, look at, so look, look. Oh, oh my gosh. Uh, what do I do? It's hot. It's amazing. Missionaries, get in here. Okay, I'm almost done, you guys. Do you have any questions? Let me get some plates for you. Are there any questions? <clears throat> Just get that pizza in my belly right now. Yeah. You guys, look at this. So it's it comes up some. Do you know what I mean? And you can eat like a whole piece yourself. I'm making you a better kind, too. This is just kind of kids, too. But do you see? Look how good. Anyway, so... What else are your questions? I just want, listen, I've said this before. I know I'm nuts. We're nuts, okay? But I am passionate about my mom's plan. This is why I started it up again. I want you guys, yeah, you can sit down too. Here. <laughs> and I just want everybody to have these yummy, amazing recipes in your life because I really believe in it. And I try everything, and I'm telling you, this food is so good. So if you don't know this pizza, it will become your new favorite. And I just try to show it to you so you're like, oh, that's easy. I can do it. Because it is. It's very easy. So our arugula one, oh, my, it's almost done. I'll be done. I don't want to waste everybody's Friday night. Has anybody else got questions? So you cut your turn. You got some comments, not questions. What? Um, Oh, okay. I love that you are feeding the missionaries. <laughs> You're so cute, Lizzie. Looks oh, stop delicious. It. Stop it. You so make nice. me so happy. Oh, Thanks for gosh. all the tips. Oh my gosh. Thank okay. you. Your wow. mom's plan works. I have been following it over 10 years. Yay! See, this is Do what I want to hear. Do you have a cookbook with these recipes? Yes, there are two cookbooks. Go to our website, thefoodnanny.com. They're the best books you will ever buy in your life. Oh my, okay, our pizza's getting done. Oh no, okay, I'll just show you this one and then I'm totally done, okay? Oh my, okay. We've gotten distracted a little bit. Look at this. Are you guys okay? Do you need a fork? It's good. Okay, awesome. look at this, okay? So now you take, this pizza is so healthy. You take the arugula. This is so delicious. So, so, so delicious. Okay. So you place a good amount of arugula on top. Then you put your cherry tomatoes. Look how yummy and healthy this is. Okay. You put your cherry tomatoes. Then the key is the salt. Oh, you put more olive oil, a little bit, a little bit more olive oil. The key is the salt, like this. And then, I forgot, my, my one pepper grinder's out. And then pepper. You guys, this pizza, oh my gosh. Okay, sorry guys, I'm almost done, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do this while guests were coming in. Where's my pizza cutter? If I may, I would tell you. <sighs> Okay, anyways, can you see how beautiful this Cut is? That. Oh, here it is. Can you see how beautiful? Anyways, this is everybody's absolute favorite. Um, I'll be done for the night. I've got all these people coming. I'm gonna be busting out 50 pizzas tonight, you know? It's, that's how it goes, super fast, super great. Anyways, um, that was the five minute crest, by the way. And then remember my, my beer one has, well, okay, I shouldn't say that with the missionaries. I'll explain it to you. This. <laughs> 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 this, 
This is the other one, okay? This is the Tuscany one that's been rising for a while. This one is so delicious. Give it both a try. Anyways, all so many delicious kinds. Um, is that it? Well, Katie would like one delivered to Burley, Idaho, please. Okay, okay. Well, just come be my friends. Come show up at my door and we'll cook, cook, cook. Anyways, love you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Talk to you later. Make sure to save it before you click out of it. And love